is a general reading this may or may not resonate okay if it doesn't check out your other placements if you need a personal reading all that information is going to be below queen of cups either there is someone who's in love with you or you're in love with someone but i have a feeling that there is a lack of communication between you guys or um there's just no talky talky right now okay i have a feeling that you're shut down emotionally you're very much in love with someone that's for sure okay but you're choosing to keep your emotions to yourself you tr you're trusting your intuition trusting your guidance but this time i feel that instead of um like the usual queen of cups who gives other people priority who doesn't put her needs first i feel this time you're putting your needs first you're loving yourself first and all your love compassion is coming towards yourself this time that's what i'm getting you do the feelings are there the emotions are there for someone but you're choosing to shut your cup this time the queen of pentacles it could be it could be that you're very focused on your career your goals uh, your money creating your own stability but what i'm getting here is that you're very focused on your own self this time you know uh sag what i'm getting is that you've been very open to someone you've been in love with someone and you've been very giving okay unconditional love always been there for that person very compassionate this time you're choosing to put all the focus on yourself you know how there's this um there's this inward focus okay it's like you're being a little greedy a little selfish with your energies right now when it comes to the opposite person here not like it's a bad thing self love is not a bad thing okay but yeah i feel that's what you're choosing to do with the 3 of cups here i feel you're enjoying your life you're enjoying yourself or there is someone here in the background here who wants to have a reconciliation with you okay the three of cups is hanging out chilling celebrating or it's christmas time it's we're heading to new years maybe you're having a good time okay but there's someone here who wants to reunite with you uh whilst you're working on yourself okay because looks like you're just not interested in being with someone you want your alone time or at least away from this person okay you're choosing to have a good time with your friends your colleagues whatever but your focus is everything but this person is what i'm getting you're wanting to work on yourself you know your focus has been this person all this while see king of cups now your your ghost this person who's now like literally in love with you now we have someone here with the king of cups okay definitely someone who's matured who's emotionally very matured and now we have the king and queen here okay which means that you both are at a very emotional level here but i'm getting one person who's chosen to shut down and focus on themselves while the other person here has finally learned to master their emotions balance their emotions being very compassionate being very giving this could be someone who you're dealing with who has trust issues also okay someone who's gone through a lot and they have a hard time opening up okay could be someone very cold someone very emotionally manipulative okay but there is this so this this element this energy of this person being with you being around you five of pentacles you could have left this person out in the cold okay this person feels very left out by you they feel very lonely isolated you know you could be giving them the cold shoulder uh you know um again like i said no communication Uh, not responding to their messages emails phone calls etc but i'm getting that there is this rift between you guys <coughs> i'm getting like you've literally uh, created this you know you've created this rift you're probably even you i'm i'm getting um this person misses you okay they literally see you like you're not giving them the importance that they always used to get from you you're not giving someone the importance or the attention that they want okay they're literally seeing you as someone who's you know like leaving them out in the cold and walking away from them this person now wants to open up to you emotionally the lovers you're going to have a very difficult choice to make sag the lovers is difficult choices but yes there is a very very strong soul bond between you guys okay 
<coughs> this could be someone where there is commitment issues with this person or there is just one of you who was emotionally involved more involved than the other person which i see you as sad i see you as someone who was emotionally more involved in this connection which was causing an imbalance out here okay this person is probably someone who's wanting to come in wanting to balance out your needs but you're going to have to make a decision sagittarius a very logistic decision whatever decision you make see to it that it's going to help you in the long term okay don't choose anything that gives you that instant gratification don't make impulsive decisions because yeah the decision is coming up for you it could be of whether you want to make a choice of getting this person back into your life or not it could be a choice of whether you want to make a deeper commitment with this person or not okay but there are choices that are going to be presented to you and these choices are going to be very uh life changing you know but there is a very strong like i said twin flame soul tie connection that you cannot ignore the chariot here there is someone here who is very willing and very determined to move forward okay this chariot is like that strength card right but uh whatever success whoever wants this success you or them right but the success is going to come only with that willingness the determination to overcome the obstacles okay to fight whatever comes in between someone's finally balanced out their emotions you know and now they're ready to move forward towards you okay there's someone coming towards you that's for sure and they want you to make a choice or they want you to choose them but this is literally the lovers always says right i love you i want you okay there is a lot of love here there's this strong connection here that you just cannot get rid of no matter what you do you can focus all your love on yourself you can focus all that compassion on yourself put all your 100 100% into focusing on your materialistic things all your pentacle money but this bond is unshakable okay four of swords but you want to take your time you want to take your time sad that's just staying silent not doing anything about it like i said either you want to move forward okay you want to let this person go and you want to move forward or there is this person here okay there there's this huge transition that's coming into your life okay from the lovers to the chariot <coughs> I feel you want to take a break. You want to think about this. You know, you you're on this energy break. You're wanting to rest and recuperate, probably because whatever you've gone through in the past, it's literally got you very sensitive. You could have turned out to be very very emotionally clingy, needy. You know, to a point where you probably drove that other person off. Okay, very desperate or someone who just lacked patience. And now you've completely withdrawn yourself, and now you need some time to think about what you want to do next with this person. Like I said, you have a choice. Page of Pentacles. Okay. Now, what I feel is that whoever is coming towards you, right, with the King of Cups and the Page of Pentacles here, I feel that there is someone here again. Page of Pentacles, yes. It is someone very diligent, someone uh, very hardworking. Um, but this is someone very immature. Okay. Again, King of Cups. This is someone who will not. show you their emotions okay the king of cups is someone who's very focused uh on you know on balancing things out okay they can be very logical but they choose not to but this is definitely someone who likes who's got that social intelligence you know so they will love you to the moon and back but still they will not show it to you okay but with the page of pentacles what i feel is that this person whatever fight you guys have had if there's been any fallout or anything this person wants to make amends to this connection okay but just let me make uh one thing very clear to you sad that yes they do have the basic feelings okay they have the basic feelings for you but the person that you're dealing with a is very very immature whether emotionally or whether uh, not emotionally sorry but uh, when it comes to um moving into something very stable they're very immature okay emotionally they're mature but um again i said could be <coughs> someone who has trust issues okay or emotionally unavailable but this person my point is that this person who you're dealing with they have the basic feelings for you but that interest is more about working on themselves they're focused on themselves they're focused on the money their goals they're more focused on the material aspect of the life rather than the emotional aspect okay you seem to be all about the emotions 
don't know why I started coughing again today. But uh, it definitely seems like you were the one who was more giving in this relationship. Okay, didn't focus on your work career goals while you were more focused on them. Okay, this person. Now that you've learned your lesson, now that you realize that this person is um, not as focused on you as you are on them, now you've changed your path, and now you're focusing on your on the other things also of life. Okay, which mean your security, your stability, or just thinking more logically, giving this a more logical approach. Okay, <coughs> but there is definitely an age difference here. Okay, age difference, uh, energetic difference, maturity difference, whatever. You're the more mature mature one here, Sat, and they're still coming in with that emotion. Uh, immaturity okay so uh their feelings may change yes from the page they may go into the the knight or the king but it's going to take a while because that's a student and that's a beginner stage here and you've already reached that queen queen and king stage so i don't know if you're ready to wait for this person to grow up <coughs> the name with the chariot here more than them it feels like you're the one who's like very determined of getting through getting out of this mess maybe for you it's all a mess maybe for you it's just getting too much and you are at a crossroads here and you need to make a very important choice of whether you want to continue waiting for this person stick to this person or you know or whether you just want to move on but the chariot here it looks like you're just like you know what i'm done you really want to move forward in life you know like get to the better things in life temperance here there's you Sarge. So whatever you're doing, Sad, something's going to need a lot of patience. Okay, it's going to require require a lot of patience. It's going to require a balance. And I think that's exactly what you're doing. You're letting it go, letting it flow. And uh, you're doing everything that it takes in order to let go of the outcome. Okay. You're being very patient with this person here. It looks like you really, really, really love this person a lot. Okay. <coughs> But if you're expecting this person to come to you go towards you with some offer, it's still not an offer. It's not a strong offer that you're wanting. Yes, they still have the basic feelings for you. So they're coming towards you because they don't want to end this on a bad note and they want to reconcile. But um, nothing very serious. Okay, it's a very it's very bland communication. But I don't know for a source. I don't know how much energy you're going to give this person or how much you're going to entertain this person. Because with the temperance here, it looks like you want to stay away from the drama, the chaos. You just want to find that peace, you know, that uh, mental balance within yourself. Because this person could have created. Because, <coughs> yeah, like I said, right. Um, there could have been a lot of recklessness, hastiness around this situation, okay? A lot of clashing, you know, you guys, imbalance. But this time, you want to maintain that moderation. You want that inner calm, that inner peace, you know, that harmonious believe, uh, harmonious relationship with yourself, if not with them, okay? And you want that peace, yeah? That tranquility, okay? And that's exactly what you're aiming for. So, yeah, you want that calm, clear mind this time, all right? So you want to find your peace and you want to feel content with where you are, okay? You don't want that impulsiveness anymore because you realize that it's bringing you nothing but pain. So yeah, let's see. What is the best potential outcome Sagittarius can expect for this spread, please? Give me the best potential outcome Sagittarius can expect for this spread. What is the best potential outcome Sagittarius can expect for this spread? Eight of Wands, forward movement, nice. <coughs> That's a lot of communication coming in back and forth, okay? Eight of Wands is quick movement. So yeah, if you guys are not in communication, it's going to pick up out of nowhere. It's going to be unexpected and it's just going to be very, very quick. And along with that, with the King of Swords here, I feel you're going to get clarity. There is someone here. I, you know what? I feel more than get like clarity with the King of Swords here. I feel that whatever communication is coming in, right? Because the Eight of Wands is all about passion, right? I feel whatever communication is going to be coming in, right? You're going to give this a very logical approach. I don't think this is the opposite person with the King of Swords here. I feel this is you who's going to give a very logical approach to this, okay? Because I see a lot of logic come from your side, a lot of practical behavior, okay? It's like you no longer want to get driven into anything emotional whatsoever. You've probably uh, been very, emo your approach has always been very, uh, you know, um, 
irrational probably when it came to this person okay you had a hard time looking you know seeing through things you know the way they were but this time it's going to be that very you got to have that strength okay and you want to have that structure that routine okay and you want to have that conversation with a with a method you know you want to have a very me- uh, a very methodical approach to this okay and you want to see to that things are fair uh for you at least if not for i mean if for both of you yes but the king of swords is someone who's wanted is wanting to be fair as someone very intellectual so yeah your approach is going to be a little cold yeah to whatever communication is coming in you probably could even ignore this communication completely okay you never know but there is communication coming in there is okay but um <clears throat> I don't know why but I feel that for some of you <coughs> you could be very happy in your life as a bachelor or very happy in your life without this person for some of you you know because you have very high standards for a partner okay and uh, you don't want to settle for a partner who cannot hold your interest I don't know why I put it out there but yeah this could be for someone because the kind of relationship that you want right it, it literally challenges your partner to excel and maintain those high standards okay and if there's someone who's not being able to you know reach that intellectual level that phys- along with that physical and emotional level you're happy to cut them out okay so yeah communication is coming in for you it's going to be very quick unexpected from this person here who's still interested in you wanting to raise the white flag but your approach is going to be a little shocking to them this time that's what i have for you saj i hope this reading resonates with you leave your comments below like share subscribe and i will see you next time bye bye